Mar Vista is a vibrant neighborhood located on the west side of Los Angeles, nestled between Venice and Culver City. The community has evolved into a sought after area known for its charming residential streets, local shops, and family friendly atmosphere. With a mix of mid century homes, modern developments, and lush green spaces, Mar Vista has something to offer everyone. Whether you're drawn to its proximity to the beach or the laid back lifestyle, Mar Vista provides a perfect balance to those seeking both comfort and connectivity in Los Angeles. It's definitely a hidden gem of a neighborhood. So today in this video, I'm gonna go over the map of Mar Vista. So let's just get right into it. I have Zillow pulled up right here. As you can see, this is all of the sold homes in the Mar Vista area. It's gonna be a pretty raw video. I'm just gonna go over what is the sales price, the average sales price, what homes are selling for out here. As you can see, Mar Vista is a pretty unique neighborhood, very family oriented, but there are a lot of younger, young professionals that live in Mar Vista too, that want to be kind of in the middle of Los Angeles between the West Hollywood, Beverly Hills area, and the Venice, Santa Monica area, because you get the best of both worlds kind of being close by the 405, which is what I tell people. So let's just start down here, south of Venice, which is where you're gonna find Culver West, Culver Garden, Del Rey, also some great family-oriented neighborhoods down there. But then you can see, we're gonna go over some of these homes to show you what you can get for $2 million. For example, this just sold in August for $2 million. You get a nice backyard, two levels with a pool down there. That's what the exterior of the home is gonna look like. And let's scroll through some of these. 1.5 on more sold in August as well. That is your typical Spanish exterior. This is what an LA home looks like right there. We don't have much to look at, but I'm going to basically just do this as if I were a tourist looking at what's been selling in the Mar Vista area. So you can see the price point hovers around the two to three million dollar range. And this is what a two million dollar home looks like. So look at the interiors of this. For two million dollars, you get a kitchen that looks like that, guys. No offense to whoever designed this kitchen in the first place, but I'm sure because it sold in September of 24, there's probably gonna be a lot of work done because I'm not sure how many people will be wanting to use a bathroom that looks like it uh, probably belongs in a hospital. But that's a $2 million home and it's a two bed, one bath, which is very interesting. This is gonna go under a lot of reno renovation. And for three million, you can get a five bed, two bath, 2,300 square foot home, large pool. Looks more like a cabin from the exterior. Interior, obviously old. When was this one built? Let's see. Shoot, 13, oh wow. First offering in 57 years, 13,000 square foot lot built in 1951. So this is definitely the original kitchen. I mean, those lights were 1951 lighting there. And you get your typical $3 million home gets you that kitchen. I know a lot of people complain about the prices in LA, but if these are selling in the month that we are currently in right now, which is crazy. Um, obviously, people think that they're getting a good deal. So we'll see when the time comes. But I'm gonna click on this one because it's four or five, one of the more expensive ones we're seeing. And it looks like it's on a large lot, private, gated, Spanish, Mediterranean, exterior. It's all we're seeing that sold though three years ago. And one five, now that's a nice niche. This one just sold recently. It looks like it is a part of a townhome community here with a private gate, modern look to this condo. Look at that, you get a great kitchen. Now this is definitely something that could be used as a solid investment. You purchase this home, you rent it out. What, a three bed, three bath, maybe close to 6,000 for the three bed, three bath. 1,600 square feet, that's pretty large. But these days in Mar Vista on the west side, it's gonna be close to Three, uh, 6,000 a month, let's say. 1,600 square feet, 2014 build. So it is not a new-ish build, but still you're getting a modern unit. I mean, who wouldn't want to be renting with, let's say two friends and have this as your outdoor patio or rooftop deck? And let's see, look at that. Now there are a lot of great investments here in Mar Vista, such as townhomes. It's not only single family houses for $3 million. 
Let's see what else we can look at here. So let's go to the map and we'll just type in Mar Vista for you guys, just so you can see from above the Mar Vista Farmer's Market. Look at that. It is every Sunday and it gives you a nice um, west side vibe, let's say. The Brentwood Farmer's Market is more kind of uppity, very, very nice, clean, uh, high end. Families will be going to that one. Um, young professionals still, just the Brentwood vibe, if you know what I mean. But here in Mar Vista, it, it's more family oriented. I'd say a lot more kids you'll be seeing in, in the Mar Vista Farmer's Market and a little more low key with the style of, um, of vendors they have there. So let's go down Venice here just to show you a little bit of the streets. Look at that. There's a nice apartment building here right off of Venice and Boise. And we'll just drive down the street so you can see what it looks like. I did do a full driving tour of Mar Vista on this channel maybe two years ago. So if you want to see me actually driving these streets, check that out. Put a GoPro on my car and I didn't do it on the map tour here. A little bit more difficult to do that. But this is what it looks like driving the main street here in Venice of Mar Vista. Let's go to, and then you're going to pass Bluey's, a bunch of different... Places to eat, Bluey's, very popular cafe, great breakfast burritos, great lattes right there. It's always very crowded, as you can see, even from this photo here. And you keep on going. This takes you all the way down to the beach. And then you got the Mar Vista Houses community. So you can see these streets on the right and on the left. These are all going to be about $2 million, guys. That's what you were seeing from the recently solds. Let's go back here. We'll scroll Zoom in a bit. Here's a $5 million house. I'm not only going to show you these expensive ones, we'll go into a little less expensive ones than these brand new moderns. That is a beautiful house. $5 million, four bed, five bath, 4,600 square feet. You get a small pool on the side of your yard, but I do know a lot of people when they think about Los Angeles homes, they complain that you don't get much side yard and your neighbor is right next to you. Well, if you're living and buying a home on the west side, you're not doing it to get a lot of land. You're doing it because you are in an area that is one of the most desirable areas in all of the country, and that is the west side. You're very close to Venice Beach, Santa Monica, Playa, Marina del Rey. I mean, you can't beat that if you're actually living here. So you're doing it for the location, and then obviously the appeal of a nice new modern is there with this one. So look at that. These are beautiful photos. Wonder who took these. I might have to find this photographer and use them myself. They, the developer of this one, taking some risks, pretty bold with the dark tub and the unique linear tile there in the glass shower. I like the vibe of the bathroom. And you got the wood paneled ceilings with skylights. They did well here. What did this go for? It sold in May. For five million, wow, what was this? Let me just look at, let me look up some details here real quick. This is a nice, nice job they did here. So it looks like sold for one nine, and then they probably put a couple million into it, and then boom, five million dollars. It sat for five months. Okay, pretty standard. Time for that, good for them. So they had that house for the summer, whatever they're doing with it. Let's keep on looking around near the park here. So now this park, let me show you this park on the map up here. Let me know what you guys think of this video as well. If you want to know more about areas such as Mar Vista, let me know in the comments what other areas you might be interested in. So you do have the Mar Vista Rec Center where there's a Mar Vista Little League. If you have young kids or uh, Little League age kids that want to play baseball, play tennis, uh, maybe join a swim team. They might have that there too. Not too sure, but look at that. They have a soccer field, very family oriented neighborhood, as I'm going to keep saying, because that's what I think of when I think of Mar Vista. When you drive around those streets, it is really like no other neighborhood on the west side. It is larger than really any other pocket um, when it comes to specific uh, nooks in and neighborhoods. Okay, and then you have everything when it comes to food. Obviously, Chipotle just stood out to me right there. All right, I'm going to go back to Zillow here and show you some of these windy roads, these curvy streets. Now let's go into a price point that is a little more affordable. Let's see. Let's go to uh, 
anything under, let's say 1.5, you know, let's say someone is wanting to spend from uh, a million to 1.5. What are you, what are you looking at here now? In Mar Vista, a decent amount. So you have a, a little more north closer to Sawtell, and that is because this area is a little less desirable when you get north of Westdale, and you are right next to the Santa Monica Airport here, which can get a little bit hectic. You see all the homes in the lower price point are right between the 10 freeway and the Santa Monica Airport, which can be a concern if you don't like a lot of noise, because expect noise from the 10 or the airport right there. And this is a very uh, commuter, a very busy street commute wise. Bundy and Ocean Park. Okay, so let's see, 1.3 million, a uh, two bed, one bath, 800 square foot home. Look at that guys, for 1.3, sold in August. I'm sure they're gonna do a lot of work to that one, but as you can see, they are selling. I mean, right now, inventory, there is a lot of inventory. Uh, homes have been sitting on the market because they're priced a little too high for where we're at currently. But here we go, 1.1 million sold in May. We don't get many photos, but looks like they have a lot of greenery here, a lot of landscaping to do in that property. 1,100 square feet, three bed, two bath, probably pretty old. That can't be accurate. Okay, 1.2, this is what it gets you. It's a good photo. Two bed, one bath, 1,000 square feet, guys. And then if you're looking to rent as well, this is what you're gonna get for a three bed, two bath, 1600 square foot. That's 6,500 a month you'll be renting there in Mar Vista. And that's right between the airport and the 10 freeway. Okay, I like the exterior of this home. You have a little, you have a garage in the back and a private gate, large lot. They did a good job with the paint in the front of the home. As you can see, it used to be, oh no. Never mind. Let's scroll down here. Solid photos. Fireplace area. What did this one go for? 1.15. Oh, okay, that sold a year ago. Interesting. So obviously, if you're going to spend from a million to 1.5, typically it's going to be a remodel, not a ready to go home. I'm seeing if any of these were ready to go. This one, okay, but that was in 2022. Market was a little bit crazy back then but great job on the remodel these photos are a little small here but let's check out the kitchen wow that's a gorgeous kitchen you've got the drop down island the dark quartz countertops i like the pendant light fixtures here they did a good job with that 1.3 for this remodel very interesting wonder Wonder what they got that one for. Interesting investment there on the west side. Let me know where you guys are from or if you know anything about Mar Vista. Maybe you lived in Mar Vista and that's why you're on this video and you just want to see what some of the homes are going for these days. Well, this is what they're going for currently. This is what they've been selling in 2024 back at the condos. Okay, and let's just one more time before we wrap up here kind of just rambling going all over the place and just showing you what there is. Now let's go let's go a little bit higher. See what the most expensive ones are. Let's go over 3 million. All right. Boom, everything over 3. Let's just sort by highest just cuz we want to see 6 million dollars 2022 1800 square feet probably what are we looking at here? Not very accurate. Okay, we're gonna move on because they probably remodeled it. Yep, that's what it was. Okay, that is a unique home on a cul-de-sac there. Definitely something you don't see every day. I wonder what the interior looks like. Not that many photos of it, wow. So yeah, you're getting, this might be a rendering, but you have a zero edge pool. This is something that you'd see normally in Beverly Hills this much yard space but six million you know if it's an investment guys you know what they say do not buy the most expensive home on the street if you want it to appreciate in value over time five four i think i've been to this one actually 2021 yep i know this home i think i did a full house tour of this home on my other channel if you want to check that out as well might be getting a, a little 
a little dark here. Let's move that up. Okay. Yeah, what do you think about these new modern homes? Would you guys buy a house like that if you had the money? Look, 5'3", you can get a nice modern farm, dark. You can... Have you noticed that in the last year or two, these developers are going with darker tones in these new builds and new developments? They're taking risks. Nobody is really liking the white modern boxy homes that you were seeing five years ago. But yeah, that's what the more expensive ones are going for in Mar Vista. So if you got four million to five million, there are solid options out there. I really like this one. This one has a nice look with the beige tones the sand tones the walk with landscaping is beautiful the olive tree probably my favorite of the ones we've seen 2024 it sold in mark or in uh, may and then yeah so then that's what you'd be getting in the high price point and then you saw in the low price point now let's just go to medium price point real quick and medium we'll start one one seven maybe because everything over one seven to two five okay now this is the money price point and you might be thinking two five is still crazy expensive especially in any other part of the country but you're on the west side you're in mar vista you're right next to the santa monica airport which is a small one but then also five minutes to lax so if you like to travel if you like to go to the beach if you like the city life this is really a neighborhood that you can do it all and you don't have to be in Mar Vista if you are qualified up to 2.5 million. There are other areas where you can get nicer homes for that price point here on the west side or in LA in general. Just let me know. I mean, I help clients all the time look for homes in this niche of a price point. One five to three million is our specialty. And so this is two five on the money three years ago, just over a thousand a foot. And this is your classic single family, family friendly home, probably, and this is a large house, 2,300 square feet. Kitchen is nice. I would prefer a kitchen a little more open than that. That's just my personal preference. If this is the walkway, small living room to the kitchen, very unique layout here, but I do like the bright tones, the decent sized yard. Let's look at what else is in this price point that has sold recently. 2,900 square feet. What are we looking at here? That nice modern property. This is a good photo. You can see the, some of the streets here in Mar Vista too. Massive streets, large sidewalks, and then plenty more space that the city will maintain with these palm trees. This is just an extravagant photo right there. This might have to be my background or my, my wallpaper, or I might just blow this up and make it a poster on my wall. I don't know. That's Pretty cool. Two five, there we go. 2,700 a foot. This one, I mean, uh, just under 1,000 a foot, 2,700 square feet. And this one just sold very recently. So let's check it out. So this is the current market of what we're seeing. So there's an open kitchen, a little more to today's standards than three years ago, pendant light fixtures, but very bright and kind of boring with the tones here with the just white counters and white everything. Um, but still very nice modern remodel here. Solid home, nice. West LA, Mar Vista, you can't beat it guys. If you're from West LA or Mar Vista or you live out here on the west side, let me know because this is just where a lot of people want to be these days. It just seems like the west side is up and coming since 2021 when it comes to just a flock of people in where you want to actually live. Now, two five, there you go. Under a thousand a foot. Okay. Well, I'm going to end it here because or else I would just ramble forever because I love looking at just brand new sold homes. I'm sure you guys do too. You guys probably could do this on your own browse Zillow, but why not do it with me here? Let me know in the comments if you want me to browse uh, any other neighborhoods as well or do street tours, map tours of different pockets. This is Mar Vista, as I said, located in one of the best pockets in LA, right between Culver and Venice. You got the airport there, you've got multiple parks, family-friendly neighborhoods, you've got homes in all, 
all over in the price range. It's a little more on the higher end when it comes to Los Angeles in general, but it, you just have to pay for where you wanna be, obviously, especially if you're gonna be in California and definitely in Los Angeles. Property taxes about one and a quarter percent. So you gotta take everything into account if you're looking seriously at homes. But that was the Zillow map tour here of Mar Vista. Hit the like button if you watched till the very end of the video here. Also subscribe for more videos, more informational videos about Los Angeles in general and real estate out here in LA. Thank you guys for watching. I have a real estate sales and marketing team out here. We help clients buy, sell, and invest in property every single day in Southern California. Feel free to reach out, text or email us down below. Thanks once again. See you guys on the next one.